शर्म कर सहन कर समझ कर चित्रों को देखकर शब्द पढ़ो उपवन अचकन अजगर पनघट बरगद कसरत खटमल बर्तन नटखट थर्मस शलगम अफसर मखमल गलगल अदरक कटहल मरहम शरबत तर्कश शबनम दर्पण जरकन इन शब्दों को पढ़ो अचरज अहमद अकबर अमजद अटकन अफजल 
गफलत गदगद जगमग जहमत खटपट खसखस चमकन चटकन झटपट झरझर उज्मन उबटन छलबल छमछम टमटम टसमस धक धक नफरत बचपन अनबन सर्कस बरकत पकड़न करवट सरहद सरबत तड़पन गड़बड़ सरपट हलचल परमल धड़कन दशरथ पलटन लटकन कतरन हरदम हरकत निम्न पंक्तियों को पढ़ो उबटन मल थर्मस भर अचकन पहन अजगर पकड़ गलगल चक पनघट तक चल हरकत मत कर नफरत मत कर
खटमल मत पकड़ टमटम पर चल अचकन पहन कर चल अकबर अजगर मत पकड़ पनघट पर बर्तन भर पनघट पर मत चल नटकट हरकत मत कर सर्कस तक अचकन मत पहन अचकन पहन उपवन तक चल कटहल पकड़ कर मत रख उबटन मल कर मत चल नफरत कर हरकत मत कर अचकन पकड़ कर रख गर्दन इधर मत कर अफसर अब घर चल कसरत कर घर चल
Dear children, we shall learn the names of animals. Cow. This is a domestic animal. It gives us milk. Deer. This is a wild animal. And it has curly horns on its head. Elephant. This is a biggest animal on the land. This is vegetarian. Horse. This is a domestic animal and it runs very fast. Goat This is a domestic animal. Its milk is full of nutrition. Lion This is a violent animal. It is non-vegetarian and is called the king of the forest. Pig This is a domestic animal. This is very strong. Birds. Dear children, we shall learn the names of birds. Sparrow. This is a small bird and generally found everywhere. Parrot. This is a domestic bird, green in color with red beak. Crow. This is found everywhere and has black color. Duck. This bird generally likes to live in water. Hen. This is also a pet bird. It cannot fly high 
and it gives us eggs also. Pigeon This is a domestic bird. This was used as a postman in the past time. Eagle The bird flies high. Its eyesight is very powerful and we call it as a hunter bird. Woodcutter Its beak is long and strong. This bird can make hole in a tree by its beak. Crane It has long legs and hunts small fishes. Flowers Dear children, we shall learn about some flowers. Lotus Lotus is the national flower of India. It grows in water. It is found in many colors, mostly in pink. Rose Rose is a beautiful flower found in different colors. It has thorns in its stem. It smells very good. Hibiscus Hibiscus is a flower found in different colors. It grows in hot areas and it is an indoor plant. Alamanda Alamanda is a climber plant. It is colorful and grows in cooler parts of the country. It is an ornamental flower. Jasmine It is a climber plant and very sweetly scented. They are generally white and sunshine yellow in color. Women in South India wear them in their hair. Sunflower Sunflower is yellow in color. We extract oil from its seeds. It grows in warm climate. Marigold Marigold flower is originally from Mexico. It grows all round the year. It is found in bright yellow, mustard, orange and in brown color. It has a pungent smell. Fruits Dear children, Fruit is not only food for us, it is mandatory for health. These are delicious too. We shall learn the names of fruits. Banana Banana is a delicious fruit. It has no seed or goodly. It is a very healthy fruit for stomach. Apple. It is good for health. It has lots of vitamin A and calcium. Their trees grow in hills area. Orange. This is orange in color. It has plenty of juice and is sour in taste. It has good amount of vitamin C 
which is good for our skin. Guava This is a pulpy fruit. It has small seeds in it. Mango This is also a pulpy fruit. Its seed is called gutli. It is called the king of fruits. Papaya this is yellow in color. It is a delicious fruit. It is an energy giving fruit and helps in digestion. Grapes These grow in bunches. It is sweet and sour and a nutritious fruit. Dear children, we shall learn the names of vegetables. Potato. This is enriched with carbohydrate. This is found the whole year. Brinjal. This is purple in color. Onion. This is a kind of root. It grows under the soil. Lady finger, this looks like a finger and is green in color. Tomato, this is a juicy vegetable in red color. Radish, this is a kind of root, it grows under the soil. Peas, rich gourd, this is green in color. Cabbage. This is covered by many layers of leaves. Pumpkin. This is big in size and found in yellow and green color. Lemon. This is full of juice in sour taste. Charatis. This is green in color and good for digestion system. Carrot. This is red in color and is a kind of root. Cauliflower. Its shape is like a big flower. Good Habits Early to Rise we should get up early in the morning. Prayer We should pray daily and thank God for the blessings He has bestowed on us. Cleanliness We should cut our nails regularly brush our teeth daily and keep ourselves clean. Daily Bath Taking bath daily keeps us clean, healthy and fresh. Exercise Daily exercise helps us to keep fit. A healthy mind resides in a healthy body. Breakfast Having a healthy breakfast every day helps us to grow fast and strong. Study we should study regularly. Help others. We should help others 
be kind to others and share your things with your friends. Early to bed. Go off to sleep early and that will keep you fresh. Colors Dear children, we shall learn about our colors. Red Blue Green Yellow Orange Magenta Black Pink Brown Days Dear children, we shall learn the names of days. There are seven days in a week. Monday Monday is the first day of the week. Tuesday Then comes Tuesday. Wednesday The third day of the week is Wednesday. Thursday, then comes Thursday. Friday, Friday is the fifth day of the week. Saturday, then comes Saturday. Sunday. Sunday is a holiday. Human body parts. Come, let's have a look at the parts of our body. Face. This is my face. Eyes. These are two eyes. We see with our eyes. Ear. There are two ears. We hear with our ears. Nose. 
This is a nose. It helps us to smell things. Lips. These are our lips. We can smile with our lips. Neck. This is my neck. It supports my head and helps me to turn it around. Hand. These are my hands. Shoulder. These are my shoulders. Fingers. These are my fingers which help me to hold things. Stomach. This is my stomach. I need to fill it up when I am hungry. Leg These are my legs. I walk and run with the help of my legs. Months Dear children, we shall learn the names of months. January January is the first month of the year. February February has 28 days. In leap year, it has 29 days. March March is pleasant. The Festival of Colors Holy lies in March. April. April is the fourth month of the year. May. The fifth month of year is May. June. June is the sixth month of the year. July. Seventh month of the year, it has 31 days. August After July comes August. It has 31 days. September The ninth month of the year is September. October, it is the month of festivals. November, November is 11th month of the year. It has 30 days. December, December is the last month of the year. We celebrate Christmas in December. Time. This is my clock. This is the minute hand. This is the hour's hand. This is the second's hand. Sixty seconds make one minute. Sixty minutes make one hour. One day has 24 hours. Letter writing. Letters can be categorized under three heads. One, personal letters or private letters. Two, official and business letters. Three, social letters. There are five parts to a letter. One, the heading. Two, the salutation or greeting.
Three, the body of this letter. Four, the subscription. Five, the signature. One, the heading. Write as full address at the top left hand corner and the date is written under it. For example, B125 Model Street, Phase 1, Chicago 52, the 30th of May 2004. 2. The salutation or greeting. Salutation or greeting is written to the person to whom the letter is addressed. Its wording depends on the degree of intimacy with the person. Examples Personal letters A. To relations Respected father Respected mother My dear brother My dear uncle, etc. If the relative is younger than you, write his or her name. The first letter of the relative is written in a capital letter. To friends, my dear Alec, dear Mike, since your friend is very close to you, never use dear friend or my dear friends. Two, official letters, examples. Sir, Madam. Use of dear has no special significance in official letters. Three, the body of the letter. This is the part of the letter which gives the contents or message to the persons to whom the letter is addressed. It should be divided into suitable paragraphs and must express in clear and simple language. The letters should begin in certain prescribed form. Examples A. Personal letters I am very happy, sad to learn.